Hello everybody and welcome back to the new save file. We are jumping in again. In the last episode we had some issues and some weird things with unlocking Tarnished Maggie, but do not worry, I sorted it out. We have now got her unlocked. She is available and ready to go. So we are going to play our first ever run as a Tarnished character. And this is actually pretty much my first ever run even trying the Tarnished characters. This is going to be all new to me. I don't really know how this character works, but I know that she was reworked a month, two months ago, something like that. Adrenaline Rush, Uncontainable Love, and Cardiac Arrest. So let's jump in and see how this goes. So we have this meter up here. I'm not exactly sure what that does. We also have Cardiac Arrest, which is on a one room charge, which probably means it recharges during the room. And we can throw it at enemies, I see, and then we can pick up hearts. Okay, and then what does... Oh, and they give us stats. Okay, so we want to be abusing the ever-living shit out of this. So, um, this may sound like a dumb question, but how do we die? <laughs> Holy shit. Um... Does it spend hearts to do cardiac arrest? We're at plus nine right now. It and then we, it puts us to minus seven. Did we just get a health upgrade? What the hell's going on here? I'm so confused. This is really cool. I'm, I'm interested. Okay. So maybe when that meter runs out, we take damage. You see there's a meter there, look. Let's just let's just wait and see. Okay, we don't lose damage yet, but it's still it's still going down. So our stack is getting more and more worn out. This is interesting. Not really what I was expecting to see, I'll be honest, but definitely interesting that we get to build stats and we've got to essentially build up and farm hearts wherever we can. Very interesting playstyle so far. It seems like we're going to have to be using and abusing this a lot in order to gain extra benefits. So... That's at plus 11 now, so I'm guessing when we get to plus 17, we'll get another health upgrade, maybe? I completely whiffed that one. Whoops. There is more enemies in here, good. But I completely whiffed that one. Okay, um, hold up, hold up, hold up. Does it give us more hearts when we kill enemies? Okay, we're at plus 13 now. We get, um, some bombs here. Lovely, lovely. But bombs, I like, I like. Okay. And we'll move on through. This is peculiar. Okay, it seems like it's going to be really hard to maintain this. Also, I didn't even talk about the fact that we've got Anarchist Cookbook. Uh, as for the question of the day today as well, what is a game that's really popular that you for some reason never really got into? What's a game that just kind of passed you by? Because I feel like there's a lot of those out there where they're just games that there's so much hype around. And you just never really, it never really clicked with you. Either because you didn't try it during the time of the hype, or maybe because it just isn't your style of game. It's it's always a little bit iffy to sort of suss out why it might be. Oh my god. Um. Okay. So I did get another health upgrade. So my question is again, how do we die? <laughs> this character seems very, very strong right now. Um... Considering the- oh my god, I just- I just spilled so much of my drink on my mouse mat. I apologize to all of you. I don't know why I'm apologizing to you, it's only really an issue for me, but I still apologize to all of you. Okay, so that was- that was somewhat worthless. Oh, okay, 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 okay. I just had to check that. It does cost us HP to use Cardiac Arrest. I did not know that at first. That does change things slightly. But considering the amount of HP you get back out of it, not as much as I would have thought. <laughs> um, Especially in situations like this where there's a ton of enemies grouped up and you can just kind of hit all of them in one big go. But yeah, as for my answer to that question, what's a game that kind of passed you by, mine has to be Undertale. Like, it's just a game that I've just never had any interest or desire to play. And I'm sure that is an unpopular opinion in the game community. So many people absolutely love that game. Oh, also, it does seem that our hearts are now draining much, much faster too. God damn, there's some, there's some items that would be so good for this character. Yeah, they're dr it's going to be really, really hard to fill up that, um, that thing now. Oh, but Leech is an interesting grab here. Um, it's all a race against the clock right now. I, I'm... I'm Definitely intrigued by this, the, the prospects of this character completely. 
Definitely. So, really, we don't want to bother with picking shit up. We just want to try and be as fast and dirty as possible with all of it. And keep our, keep our bars a chunking. Okay, at least one of these bombs hit her. Probably should have waited for these, uh, these flies to start doing their thing before I... Use my cardiac arrest there, but that's okay. It does seem to do a good amount of damage on hit as well. Okay. Okay. We did get a devil deal here. Um, I don't know if I should be swapping away HP, to be honest. Ooh, interesting. There is a black heart there that we can grab for damage, which I guess I will take. The actual thing itself there isn't very useful to us, but let's keep it going. We are at plus 9. Um, sorry, not plus 9. Uh, plus 17 out of 23 here. So it's feasible we could get another heart upgrade here. Uh, I don't know if this will quite now. Nah. Okay, they can't they can't jump over the gaps, really. So that makes things harder. Do you know what? Oh, I was going to say, let's just leave this room. There's a door open there. How did I not foresee that that door was obviously a door mimic? That was really dumb of me. I should have been able to see that. And honestly now, seeing how it's more feasible to die... I'm, I'm feeling, I'm feeling the pain. So the champion doesn't help either. I will grab that. I realise it takes extra time, but we found a secret room too. Huzzah! That was all part of the plan. Uh, we got whatever the hell this is. I do not recognise whatever this is. Oh, what the hell? Okay, that's good. Uh, the shredder. Interesting. I have not seen one of those yet. I've had that mod installed for. A very, very, very long time now. And yeah, that's literally the first time I've ever seen one of those. Okay, these enemies did not produce any hearts when I hit them with the cardiac arrest. I'm not quite sure why, but they did not. Maybe they have to have a certain amount of health in order for that to trigger. But that time it worked just fine. Interesting. Oh, I lost my eternal heart. You doof. You big doofus. You fool. Okay, it's, it's basically like a, a sort of collectathon type character, really, isn't it? You're really in a race against time to collect as many of these as you possibly can. I do see over there a tinted rock as well, by the way, so I'm gonna do this, and that should get birth, I think. There you go. Soul hearts aren't particularly useful to us, I don't think, but they will protect our eternal hearts, so that is one good use, I suppose. Like... Taking contact damage to get more hearts seems like a, a really valid strategy as this guy, to be honest. Okay, we're up to plus 11 again. Ooh, this is going to be a constant grind. But yeah, un Undermine... Not Undermine, sorry. Undertale is just one of those games that just never really grasped me the way it grasped everyone else. And I mean everyone else. I don't think I know a single other soul that doesn't like Undermine. Everyone fucking loves those games. And I just... I tried playing the first one, and I refunded it after about two hours. And I, I like, I, I will say, I gave it a fair shot as well, because I had watched it, and I'd had friends talk about it to me. It wasn't just like, I played the first little bit and thought, nah. I did actually give it a fair shot. It just, it just wasn't for me. It's just the way it is sometimes. Also, this, this room is not, not being handled very well at all. Also, this enemy is, is a just absolute... Terrible enemy for me. Okay, got that brain. Good. We're still at plus A. We're not doing too well on that. Bubbles are going off. Where's this last enemy? There you are. Could this little tear get out the way, please? I'm on a time limit here. <laughs> also, I managed to crush the lily pad there. Fuck's sake. Backstabber. Also pretty good. Right. Keep moving on. We do start with lower speed as this character as well as normal. I think we just need like a strong grouping of enemies to get our next heart, really. I don't think it's going to work too well with the current setup we got going on. Because it's so hard for us to gain extra hearts and keep them. We need to be rapid firing getting multiple enemies in one go. I'm hoping backstabber here is going to be pretty good. I mean, it's a very, very good item. Oh, it goddamn missed. How dare you miss? 
Okay, yeah, getting getting like something to recharge our active faster would be really nice here. Oh, this is just gross. Does it work on these guys? Oh, it does. Okay. Okay, got back up to plus 15. We're getting there. We're getting there. It does a good amount of damage as well, actually. It's like good offensively and defensively. Oh my god. I'm taking so much pointless damage right now, but it's, it's fine. Hey, we did it. We got to the next level. Okay, more HP. More HP. Good, 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 good. I like that. Give me all the hearts, give me all the hearts, give me all the hearts. Honestly, Backstabber will just take care of these guys. It'll just kill them. There you go. It did. <laughs> Ain't gonna worry about that. This is gonna give us a damage down now, I think. But it should be a damage up later. Health down? God damn it. I worked so hard for my health ups and you're gonna do this to me? That's just rude. That is just rude. But yeah, I think right now we got pretty pretty shitty damage because I, I just took that item that lowers your damage but gives you a damage multiplier. It's one of those things that it's kind of a risk to take it, but later on it should pay dividends. Okay, this one, okay. Oh, I see. Now it's 28. Okay, it's actually based on the amount of hearts that we currently have. That's That's probably better. It's not just like how many times you've done it. We got our health down, and so it's lowered the requirement for next time. I wonder if there's any bonus for actually killing an enemy with it. So... Oh, why do I keep doing that? Hitting enemies that are over gaps. That's just useless to me. It does seem to drain quicker sometimes than others. And I'm not exactly sure why sometimes it drains quicker than others. Like right now, that the hearts are draining pretty fast, but earlier it seemed like they were draining fairly slowly. I'm not 100% sure what causes the different rates at which it drains. I think I can get another heart here if this guy doesn't die. Oh, he died. Uh, the sun, yes. Why not just pop it in here? Okay, we were at plus 20, but it's going down pretty fast. Pretty darn fast. That missed? I didn't hit a single one. Also, Leech and Little Haunt, what a great team. What a great team. These guys work together so damn well. But this enemy doesn't do anything because it's invincible, so we've got to wait for the little brain stem to pop up. Any rooms like this are going to constantly waste so much of our time. In terms of gaining hearts, it's going to be sad. Just hold off, hold off, boys, hold off. There you go, there you go. We can always get more out of it if we just bide our time. Oh, uh, there's a thingy room here that still dealt damage to me for some reason. Good, good. Lodestone there, very, very, very nice. I don't know why it dealt... Oh, because it was a cash room door that it was hidden over. That's just rude, game. That's just rude. I have to say, I'm still failing to see how you die as this character. Like, as long as, you, as long as you're not stupid, which admittedly I have been a few times, you just constantly gain HP, have an easily renewable way of healing back to full health. The only caveat is you have to be very, very aggressive with your, like, where you, you, you place yourself. Gimme, gimme. We're at 25. We can get this. We can get this. There we go. We did it. We're back up to the health we were on before. I'm guessing this is where things get a bit harder for us. Good, good. Up to five. Pop another one of those. We can go straight to the boss here, to be honest. Oh, it's so good for just, like, the piercing damage it gives as well. A really good part of it. Honestly, I'm loving my buddies here. BFF would not go amiss here. Did the hearts fade slower when we're fighting a boss? It kind of felt like it. Oh gosh. 
We're at plus 15. Again, I might just like... Can I just kind of farm? I, I missed. Okay. That's where things can go wrong. That's where you can die. If you just miss. Because you spend HP on literally nothing. Also, if you walk directly into the enemy. What is he going to give us? That is actually maybe really good. Yeah, because now it's very easy for us to earn hearts. This girl seems like she should be a de devil deal fiend, honestly. Like, it's going to be so easy for us to gain hearts here. Not when I get an enemy like this, it's not, but ignore that. There's one. And it's like, there's just like sort of back and forward that you're going to be doing with this character all the time. What the hell's this? Treasure shed rooms spawn unlocked. Uh, actually, that's it's not that bad, actually. And we do already have a gulp trinket. I don't know how we gulped it, I'll be honest, but... We do already have a gulp trinket, so I'll take it. I'll take it. Okay. Now that was a large amount of hearts there. Didn't quite get the second one we needed. This should do it. Still didn't do it. Bloody hell. Now that That'll do it. <laughs> that gave us so much. Holy shit. Again, just the fact that it can kill an enemy as well is crazy. It does so much damage. This character's a lot of fun. I'm really enjoying her. Uh, the playstyle is just a, a little bit strange to me just because I feel like, like I said, it's kind of how do you die sort of thing. But um, I'm sure we'll figure that out when we die because I'm sure we will. There'll be some... Some revelation that I make that makes it very obvious how you die. Honestly, Lodestone's pretty good with this setup. Oh, I really shouldn't have killed all those little spiders. That could have been amazing. Fuck her off. You stole all my bloody charges, you fuckers. That was horrible. Again, these guys should have waited on them, but it's okay. We're at 15 now. Bloat's going to be a little hard to utilize. Uh, excuse me, what the fuck hit me then? We lost our eternal heart, but honestly, who cares? Beautiful. Still no devil deal. I'm like, wh I I'm just like, why am I getting no devil deals? And then I'm instantly realizing it's because I keep taking damage, you fool. I'm constantly taking red heart damage. Of course I'm not going to get devil deals. What the hell? You just ate that heart off me. You sick bastard. How could you? Also, I smelted another trinket. What the heck? Oh, you bastard. Okay, I have to drop this because it... <laughs> wait, 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 wait. Actually, I don't know. I don't know. This seems kind of funny. The heart can keep going. Okay, and it can trigger more than once. Okay, this is a meme. <laughs> what is this? <laughs> you see it just like traveling around. The fact that it can hit multiple enemies is pretty awesome. I kind of love that. I kind of love that. I mean, absolutely love that. That's hilarious. Oh, Play-Doh Cookie as well. Hell yes. I love Play-Doh Cookie. But yeah, like, basically just fire it and see what happens. Sometimes it won't hit anything, but a lot of the time it'll hit something. It does make it potentially quite a lot harder to use 
because it's going to hit enemies that are further away. But, I don't know. I'm kind of down for the meme factor of all of this. Okay. Oh, for God's sake. Okay. I didn't lose my devil deal. It's fine. Get away from me, sir. God damn it. Clickety clacks, why do you have to exist? I can't take you all out at once. Okay, I, I managed it somehow. Oh, this is hilarious. The fact that it just hit the same enemy twice is hilarious. Okay. Be calm. Take it moderately easy. But only moderately easy, though. Look at that. Oh my god. What the hell is this? Okay, we somehow got out of that alive. We get the negative. We've made it to boss rush. Um, we get this guy, which I think Lump of Coal would be extremely good with. So I'm really hoping we get it. Okay. God damn it. <laughs> I do think this is worth taking, though, for Boss Rush. I realize we lose th the other thing, but... Uh, Grant's Random Worm Trinket. <sighs> intruder. I think we should go with Intruder here. Really? Worst enemy first. Thank you. Gotta do the worst enemy first, haven't you? Are you Peep or are you Champion Blurt? I don't know. Oh my god. This is a bad combination of bosses. I can't fucking move. Ugh, I hate this bicycle fucking bitch of a boss. Boss sucks. Big willies. Okay. Just go away. As a boss, you're not fun. Oh god. Oh wait. Did I just lose hearts by taking damage to that? I don't think I did. I don't know. I'm confused. Intruder has activated. Lovely. This is all very confusing. Again, not great bosses to have together at once here. I'm not a big fan of the combination we have right now. Stop hitting me, you fuck. Got okay damage going. You're dead. I think I killed the other boss as well at the same time there somehow. Hit him again. We just want to get as many hits as we possibly can each time we use Cardiac. Which, we can't really aim it, so we don't know if it's going to happen. But we could just pray and hope, I guess. We haven't managed to get up to 12 hearts once in this fight, which kind of scares me. I would have thought that would have been one that wouldn't have been too hard to get to, but apparently it's not going so hot. It's it's because I'm like losing hearts so fast. Why am I losing hearts so fast? Like, look at the speed at which I lose hearts. Why is the bar going down so fast? I don't understand. I'm confused. Why does the bar go down so fast? Right, let's leave Trinity outside and see if we can... Okay, now I'm just confused. We can't restart Boss Rush anyways. I think we're going to have to leave that there because it's clearly not working. 
Yeah, now I'm just confused. I don't really get how this character works at all anymore. Why did I die then? Like, the time was ticking down, and I'm guessing that's why I died. I'm honestly not so sure. Died again? Confusion? We got the boss already. What? I'm I'm genuinely so confused. You know how I was saying, how do I die? Well, we figured out it's by whatever's going on right now. Because I can't figure it out. I mean, these guys are killing me in one hit right now. I really need to get another heart going, but... Proving to be way harder than I expected. Okay, that time I didn't get any health from that enemy. And I, d again, don't know why. I'm very confused at what's happening here. Also, this boss is just not a good boss for us to be fighting at all. Where are these troll bombs coming from, too? Okay, I think I'm just dead to this boss, because I can't figure out exactly how this boss works. to five yet? Literally, how have we not got to five that entire fight? What, what happened there? I am so perplexed now. I don't know what's going on. I'll be honest, I have no idea what's going on. At this point, I'm just confused. Oh, dude, fucking horn! Stop stealing my kills! That's another heart for us. Yeah, I don't I don't get what progresses the rate at which our bar depletes. I'm not quite sure what progresses that rate. You stop using it in rooms like this, it makes no sense. I'm guessing we have this glowing effect is when we're taking damage, maybe? I don't know, so when this bar runs out, am I going to take damage? In theory, yes. But I, I really don't know. I really do not know. Yeah. I wonder if Herming works with this thing, because Herming seems like it'd be really good. I think we're doing fine right now. Completely missed, god damn it. And I took damage, god damn it. Didn't completely miss that time. Okay, through we go. Ow. Taking damage isn't that bad of a thing, though. Don't worry about it. But, yeah, I just like, how are we only at 2 out of 12? I picked up so many hearts, and I feel like they can't have all depleted that quickly. Does taking damage deplete them? It must, right? It must. We're at minus 15? I'm, I, 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 I just have no idea how this character works whatsoever. Everything that I thought I knew is entirely incorrect. I don't know what the hell's going on, I'll be honest. M minus 15 and my health, my, my, my bar's depleting like super quick. And then I just died, but I just... And now it's at minus zero? What? This is so confusing. Why does it keep changing? What is the inf influencing factor? Is it how many hearts I picked up? Because it incremented when I went... I don't understand this character. At all. <laughs> I thought I knew what was going on. I thought I was in the know. But then, yeah, what 
What the hell was happening there? I'm I'm so confused. Like, I kind of get that the bar depletes, and when it depletes too much, you take damage. I get that. And when you get it to a certain level, you get a heart. And the more hearts you get, the harder it is to get another heart. But I'm not quite sure what influences the rate at which it depletes. It seems to be how many hearts you've picked up, but then sometimes it randomly resets to zero. But then sometimes I seem to take damage even when the bar hasn't depleted, or at least I didn't think it depleted. And then also, I seem to be picking up a ton of hearts, and... They're depleting so fast that I I don't, I don't I don't even know. If anyone can teach me how to play this character, I would be very happy about it because I, I don't know. At the start, it seemed like a character that you just can't die as because you just get so much health back. But by the end, I'm just so confused. Anyways, I hope you guys enjoyed and I'll see you guys in the next one.